Kia ora and welcome to week four of my Picture My Life uh, project that I'm working on in 2022. Uh, you can find me on social media as Scrappy Kia, which includes YouTube as well as Instagram and other places. I'd love to see you around. Um, it's been great to see so many new subscribers recently, so thank you for joining. And if you haven't already, um, hit the like and subscribe. Um, this week I am documenting sort of the last of my summer break as a teacher. Um, it's sort of the last week of freedom and I shouldn't skite about it too much but it is lovely having most of my family back at work and have had um, having had a few days to myself. Um, we did have a very busy week we also had my daughter's um, engagement barbecue at our place so we had some family staying so my parents came to stay um, my sister stayed at a house that she uh, booked around the road um, and we had a lot of Alicia's friends and things come over on the Saturday night for sort of a celebration barbecue of her engagement. So um, you can sort of see her cake there, uh, the DNA sign. Um, so that was their names instead of and we had the N tucked in there which I sort of made the semi-title um, page there. My cat's enjoying the hammock even though there was sort of a confetti balloon that had popped there and that had spilt on their sort of window seat hammock that they've got. Um, I enjoyed some lovely walks, some with my daughter, some down around Lake Hayes, so some ladies um, from our church uh, every second Wednesday, walking Wednesday, head off for a bit of a walk somewhere and we've sort of been choosing local trails and places that we've been able to adventure onto. Um, so instead of the whole week four there, you can see I've just stuck the number four. I have used pretty much the Sawyer collection. So I've used the Sawyer Picture My Life cards, which are beautiful lavenders and pinks and blacks and whites and greens, a lot of the softer colors, and they just helped the photos really stand out. Um, and that's the Sawyer stickers that you can see there. The other thing that I have done this week is I actually printed my photos smaller so that I could fit more photos onto each of the little, um, the cards, the four by six cards or the two by three cards that are on here. And so by doing that, I've been able to fit some more photos on and to make them even smaller again, I printed them with a border on my selfie. So that gave me a little bit more um, wiggle room so you could see some of the gorgeous colors of those um, Sawyer Picked My Life cards coming through. So this sticker set has, um, comes with the papers, you have to buy the papers and the stickers, but there's some really cool sort of wee tabs and I'm using some of them here just to label some of these photos uh, and label some of the parts to this picture, uh, parts to the page. So one of the problems with even weeks is that I'm sort of, I have to work with what I chose to, uh, which pocket size or orientations and things I chose in the odd week. So this is on the back of what I had done um, in week three. So it did create a few um, barriers, but uh, not barriers, a few sort of um, th extra thinking processes, we'll call them. Uh, so that was why, part of why I did the smaller photo, but I actually really like the smaller photos on here and showing these borders pop through. So I have a feeling I'll be doing this a little bit more often as well. Um, yeah, so really enjoying using these Sawyer stickers and things on here as well as the, the Picture My Life cards to go with that collection. Really helps to tie things together, um, makes the pages nice and simple once you've chosen the cards that you want uh, and gives room for pulling in some little extra embellishments and you know they're going to go together because they're all part of the same collection. Um, if you know my scrapbooking style, I'm not always one, one that fits with um, what the instructions say or what the sets are but when you're doing a project like this and you're wanting to put together something each week uh, it does help to have products that coordinate nicely so whatever uh, it is that you're using it works really well to be able to do that so um, yeah it's just I'm just now going through and choosing some of these florals some of the different bits and pieces that will work nicely in here so one of the um, picture my life cards a smaller one so this is one of the two by three I believe they are I might be a bit confused there but anyway um, I've got that there and done the journaling on that in the center now the 
cards did look like they needed something else. They were sort of getting lost into the background. So I'm using the white pen to go around some of the photographs and some of the cards I've used the black pen uh, to go around those here. So I'm just doing that with the black pen. Now it's a good idea to use the thicker nib for those when um, you're using them for outlines and things like that unless you're wanting a really soft line hey um so that's week four of my picture my life i hope that you've got some ideas for your own documenting thanks for watching